You've heard of the lack of masks and protective gear for our healthcare workers in New York City. But there's something else these hospitals are missing that no one is talking about. Food. Many hospitals around New York no longer have food or coffee available. So frontline workers pulling 18 hour days only have what they bring from home if they have time to make something or what they find from the few open restaurants nearby. And it could have stayed that way if it weren't for Cole Riley. This is the inspiring story of a normal guy who's collected over $10 million worth of food and drinks to donate to our healthcare workers so that they have the energy to protect us during this crisis. This is Cole Riley, and just three weeks ago, he launched Founders Give. I was building a company called Founders Market, which was a media company for food and beverage brands across Brooklyn. Then, three weeks ago, when this crisis hit New York City, I started seeing a bunch of these small food brands having trouble donating their product to hospitals. I thought it was crazy, but when I started calling hospitals, I soon found out why. These hospital workers, already overworked, didn't have the time to spend coordinating a million small donations from each company that wanted to donate. So they just rejected them, even if the product was sorely needed. This gave Cole an idea. He used to have a yogurt company and had a relationship with a warehouse in Brooklyn. So he called up the owner of the warehouse. I was thinking, if I brought all these different food brands together, pooled their products into one warehouse and delivered them as one, then the hospitals would take them. The warehouse owner donated some space and Founders Give was born. Little did Cole know, getting food and beverages to the hospitals was more important than he thought. Because of the pandemic, many of the cafeterias and lounges in the hospitals closed because they didn't want people gathering together. This is why there was no food or coffee anywhere to be found. When he found this out, Cole realized the hospitals are gonna need a lot more product than he thought. So I started cold calling some of the biggest food brands across the country. Turns out these companies were also struggling to donate because they wanted to donate more product than the hospitals could take. They needed someone like Cole to organize. Within a week, he had companies like Chobani, Hershey's, Kind, and Sabra pledging hundreds of thousands of products to these frontline workers here in New York. Three weeks ago, Cole was a filmmaker. Now he's managing hundreds of thousands of donations to 36 New York City hospitals on an iPad and Google Sheets, working 18-hour days. And it's working. By combining products from some of the biggest brands in the world with local products from local brands, Cole was able to start delivering products to hospitals. For these brands, it's a way to give back. And for the hospital workers, it's a lifeline. You guys have seen our angel. We've been actually giving food out to not only the staff members, but their families. Some of them are going under really, really hard circumstances at home. And the things you do are wonderful. Thank you so much. These hospitals are ecstatic about what we're doing. I mean, many of them were largely ignored. No snacks or drinks for weeks. We want to make sure that everybody, all the frontline workers across New York, are being taken care of. So Cole, I've got to ask before we go, what made you think you could do this? I didn't even really have time to think about it. I mean, I saw the problem, had a unique solution, and I just did it. And it's a really scary time right now. But I think people would be surprised at how much they can do if they just ask themselves, how can I be helpful? Founders Give is my way of giving back. I'm Cole Riley. This is Founders Give. Rally on. Rally on.